Fisherman, maybe just fishing in this lake here. Yeah. So, uh, all closed up. So we've been going for about three hours or just over since the train station. Don't think it should be long before I get to Rinheim Huts. My plan is that I'll camp somewhere not far from there. Maybe the weather's like today. I'll do a descent of Snow Hetter tomorrow. Forecast is uh, good for the afternoon, but maybe a little bit cloudy in the morning, so we'll see how it goes. Bring you back soon.
go across this bridge somehow, I think. Oh Lord, I'm going to film it. Uh, with people up there are uh, taking a slightly different route, maybe. Wish me luck. Well, I survived. My feet were a bit wet, I think it was a good idea to take my socks off. Um, I think this couple now have got to give it a go, having to see me uh, get across without too much bother, really. Might just leave it while he's still coming across. Never expected to get this close. I'm downwind, so and I'm just off the path. Site. I don't think I'll be able to camp here. It's in very placid. That's the first day from Kongsvall to where I'm camping now. Beside the lake on the way to Snowheim and Snowheader. From Renheim Hut. So, just a quick um, update on my trip across the map today. So, I started at Kongswall and made my way up this Stropschel to Darlin. I haven't pronounced that right, I know that. And then past these two lakes, that's where the fishing huts were to Ranheim and then I've come up this path here and I'm camped beside this lake which is Fischjona probably doesn't sound anything like that but that's all I've said um, so tomorrow the plan is that I go depending on the weather Snow Hetter and down to Amotsdal Hitter, um, and I might either stay in the hut or I might um, camp somewhere close by. I'll see what see what the weather's like and how I feel. Bad first day, really. Um, bit of a unusual trip, this for me. I'm um, in that I've never done an extended backpacking trip, probably since I was about 17 or 18. Most I've done really is a couple of days, two or three days, really. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how I get on. First day's gone all right. Um, wasn't a huge day to day, about um, six hours or so uh, altogether. It took me about just over four hours to get to Renheim and then had a bit of a rest there and, um, and then a bit of a stroll up here. Um, Zach was heavy. Um, I think it must have been about 15k with everything in. Uh, so, you know, water and 
Korean fuel. And obviously on Korean food for seven days. Um, so I certainly felt that and I'll probably feel that tomorrow going up snow header. But I'm just going to take my time. Um, and I think the thing which might uh, be the real issue is the weather tomorrow. I think the last forecast I saw was it was supposed to be overcast tomorrow morning but getting out in the afternoon so I'm just fingers crossed the summit will be clear. Anyway it's all good so far. I'm just having a cup of soup and then I'm gonna have the um, first of my meals gradually start taking some of that weight out of the sack. Um, so I've got six or seven nights I think yeah seven nights all together. Um, it's Sunday today um, and I my last night here in Dove Rochelle will be Friday night hopefully and I'll be in Snowheim and then on the Saturday I'm just walking down to Kongsvall um, easy day to get the train about five um, so yeah so I've got I think six nights on a Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday yeah, six nights on and seven days walk um, see how it goes um, probably see you tomorrow <laughs> Fantastic sunrise this morning. Not that it ever really gets dark here. Some weird looking clouds. Summit of Snow Hatter, um, share my reviews. It's uh, well worth it. Uh, I'm a bit cloud when I go down a bit. The wind's been absolutely wild. It's fairly wet up here. Mostly up. Come from uh, Snow Hatter.
This is the other side of the summit. Uh, not sure what this is. Probably a weather observation or something. Anyway, I'm going to head to. Uh, I want to start here now and follow these red marks. Hopefully, uh, no big snowfields to cross or anything. Shame about the cloud, but uh, can't have everything. It's been a good trip so far. I'll bring you back later. Well, the trail's uh, reasonably well marked so far. Still in the cloud, as you can see. slide just back there. Tweak one of my fingers but I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, I'll bring you back when I come out of the cloud. See you soon. Cloud's just beginning to clear. Um, not sure what that uh, big tarn is called. Um, the valley floor looks amazingly light. A little bit further up, I could almost, you know, almost would have thought that it had uh, actually snowed. But it's, um, there is a lot of very light sandy gravel. I noticed yesterday. Uh, maybe it's just that. to get off this boulder field. Not my favourite territory in the world. See you soon.
This is the oldest part of the hut. Yeah, no. no one would believe me. 